Yo, what is going on guys? Buenos dias. Uh, today I'm going to be sadly stripping my old V8 solenoid engine for parts and I'm going to be redoing it. Uh, I just felt like I needed to redo it for a bunch of reasons. Reasons that I will get into in just a few minutes. It's a very sad day, but also a very good day at the same time. So, let's get started. If John Miller wants to come sit down with us, we would love to have him. Okay, so there were a couple things that went wrong with the old crankshaft in my last video. Number one, it was just way too long. The power wouldn't reach the end as well as it should have. And because of that, the pistons would actually lag. It would create just awful lagging. And reason number two kind of deals with reason number one, but the stands at the bottom, I couldn't get them correctly lined up and it would create a lot of friction. So in this next one, I'm going to make it really short really lightweight. So that concludes my boring interlude. Now we can start building stuff. Okay, testing number one. That is super cool. That's not bad for a first go. That was amazing. 
I am so happy that worked the first time. Usually it takes a really long time to get it to work, but that worked right off the bat. So I'm gonna keep tinkering around with this. There is gonna be a part two to this video. I think I'm gonna lay the pistons down flat. I know this is a V8 video, but I just wanna test it out. Um, so stay tuned for that. Thank you guys for watching. That is it for this video, and I will see you next time.